Now for a brief conversation with a 2012 laureate in India via Polycom Technology, please welcome Polycom's Executive Vice President and Chief Marketing Officer, Jim Kruger. Well, good evening, everybody. Polycom is extremely proud to be the global communication sponsor of the Tech Awards for the sixth consecutive year. Every year, it is our great honor to welcome former laureates from all over the world to the Tech Awards stage through our Real Presence video technology. And every year, without fail, we are humbled and inspired by their intellect, their innovation, and their noble pursuits. Nowhere do we see finer examples of the profound ways technology can improve lives than here at the Tech Awards. Tonight's honorees, like those who have come before them, have created something extraordinary that has changed the world for the better. They are truly shining examples of how an individual with a brilliant idea and a practical application can better the lives of thousands or even millions across the globe. On behalf of all the employees at Polycom, I'd like to congratulate the laureates of 2013. I would also like to thank 2012 laureate Pia Sorkar, who's the founder and CEO of TeachAids. She'll be joining us in just a moment here, live from Hyderabad, India. Pia and her organization are doing life-changing work, providing HIV education to more than 200 organizations and governments across 73 different countries. Polycom is also pleased to make it possible for Indian film star Anushka Shetty, to, who serves as an ambassador for TeachAids, to defy the boundaries of distance by joining Pia in Hyderabad for the conversation with TeachAids chairman and co-founder, Shuman Gosmanjunder, here directly in, in Santa Clara. We look forward to hearing all the laureate stories tonight, and now I'd like to introduce a video of Pia and Anushka to get us started. Thank you and have a wonderful evening. of HIV. It begins with me. Hello, what can I do for you? Doctor, I've heard a lot about HIV, but I don't really understand what it is. Could you explain, please? Sure. It's a very serious health topic. My name is Pia Sorkar. I teach at Stanford University, and I'm also the founder and CEO of Teach Aids. We were a laureate for the Tech Awards last year in the education category. The Tech Awards has really changed our organization. It's allowed us to connect with other organizations and leaders of those organizations to learn about the kinds of problems that they were facing around the world and getting their materials out, just as we were facing similar problems. And we were able to come together and talk about these problems in ways that we could solve them together and get all of our materials to people around the world that need them most. On behalf of the TeachAids organization, we would like to thank the Tech Awards for all of your support and your contributions and your kindness to allow us to continue our mission to provide the most effective HIV education around the world to those who need it most. Thank you. The Polycom interview will be conducted tonight by Shuman Gashmajamdar. He is a talented technologist, entrepreneur, author, former fraud czar at Google, and co-founder of TeachAids, a 2012 laureate. He will speak with Stanford professor and TeachAids CEO, Pia Sokar, to whom he is married, and Indian film actress and TeachAids advocate, Anushka Shetty, both of whom join us now from Hyderabad, India. Welcome to all three of you. Thank you so much. It's a delight to be back here at the Tech Awards. I love that the purpose of the Tech Awards is to recognize how technology benefits humanity. 
Technology, of course, allows us to do things at a scale that we wouldn't be able to achieve as individuals. I saw this firsthand in the work that we did at Google, and I left Google to co-found TeachAids, which was based on my wife Pia's research at Stanford, which invented a way to be able to achieve that scale for something as vital as HIV education. Good morning, honey. Must be pretty early there. <laughs> Yes, yes, honey, good evening. And yes, it's pretty early here, but we're so happy to be with you today. And with me is Anushka Shetty, one of the most famous celebrities across all of India. And she so generously had donated her voice towards the TJ's animations for India. Thank you, Pia. Hello, everyone. It's such a pleasure to be here today. Pia, would you mind sharing a bit about how TJ started? Yes, of course. So it was in uh, 2005 that I started reading these reports coming out of India that said it was to be the next hot zone for people living with HIV. And that despite hundreds of millions of dollars that had been poured into these uh, materials and these uh, educational efforts, that the awareness levels and the knowledge levels were still very low. Turns out it's extremely difficult to teach about a taboo topic like HIV, but we were able to bring together a world-class team of experts to develop technology and a research-based solution to take not just to India, but across the world. We actually started it right here in Hyderabad because of a tragedy that took place here. Yes, when I met Pia in 2009, the taboo was so strong here that children who had HIV positive were expelled from schools and nobody took care of that because they were busy just taking care of themselves and the kids and they were not ready to listen to us forget learning about what HIV was about. And Pia tried really hard because the issue was so sensitive and the materials that we've developed were either banned or was not effective enough. So the whole matter had to be dealt very delicately without hurting them. Pia with her team came out with quite a few materials to break through this ignorance and eventually she came out with some localized animations which could break through our culture and our mindset. It was very difficult, I definitely must say that, very difficult to get across through all the masses, but eventually I was surprised that uh, how they took to it and the transformation of thought that they had in such a short period of time. And uh, they embraced the material and the government has distributed 25,000 copies to schools and in villages where we don't have electricity. They've uh, put it on mobile projectors and shown it to the villagers. And all the kids who were expelled from school have gotten back to schools and the very parents and educators who threw them out have brought them in and they're also supporting us to spread the knowledge further. And tonight we have a very exciting announcement. Anushka, why don't you? No, yeah, you should do that. <laughs> <laughs> So we were able to secure distribution agreements to get these materials out to more than 100 million children this year. And that too for free. And All the material that's gone out has been for free. For free and. Uh, which has been why very, very challenging to get it across. And I'm so glad, on behalf of my colleagues, I would say that we're so glad to be a part of this. And you always have our support. And we're so proud of Teach Aids for helping us to do this for our country. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Uh, it was a team effort. Um, Shimon, I think we're just about out of time, so we'll toss it back to you. Thank you so much for allowing us to share this exciting news with you today. And thank you to the Tech Awards and to Microsoft for sponsoring the Education Award we won last year. And finally, thank you to, to Polycom for allowing me to speak with my wife and uh, for facilitating this wonderful thing today. Thank you.